All right, everybody, welcome back to the Game Vault. I'm Captain Beefy, and this is Stray, and we're going to do some more cat stuff. Uh, so we just recently solved the puzzle here to end the last episode. Now we're going to move forward and see what's happening next. Game so far, great graphics, great design. It's fun. I mean, I couldn't play this for 100 hours or anything like that. I understand it's... Uh-oh. Not that long of a game. Let's see what's up with this dude. Hey, dude. No? Okay. But it is kind of a trip. And there we go, doing more cat stuff. What's that? Alright, we found something. I'm gonna have to put it in something. Oh, we knocked his head completely off. That's kind of terrible. Is that a cat? That's a little cat statue. Look at that thing over there. Not sure what I have to do with this, if anything, but... We'll look around for a minute. Hmm... I want to drop it. Does that say something on it? We have to take it back out here. Something has a missing part out here, maybe? This? No, that's just a handle we stand on. Oh, but that comes back now. Does that change anything, I wonder? Apparently not. There's something up here. Up, oh, up. Oh. Up. Oh. Look at that. Cuteness factor doubled. That's our little drone. Oh, he don't look so good. More cat stuff. B12. Named after, I assume, the Studio Blue 12. Isn't that the studio name? Or is it named after the vitamin? Only time will tell. Go on. There you go. Two cat stuff. Okay, it's trying to communicate with us. And as a cat, of course, I understand it. Okay. So there is our hands. What do you need to do? Suck out my life force to run your battery? What? I get a little backpack. Yep, doing cat stuff. Okay. 
<laughs> That's so weird. All right, so uh, look at him walking funny because you put that on him. Yeah, put a harness on a cat, and then they do weird stuff like that. All right, where's the door we had to... Oh, you just going to lay down. Yeah, you got to get used to it, bro. <coughs> you don't have the opposable thumbs. Oh. Hmm. Of course. Okay. Oh, look at that. So we have memories, okay. Yeah, let's beat it. Is this where I have to go? Aha. Uh -huh. I hope this will work. Alright, so we need to find a door out, he said. And obviously this room is locked up pretty tight. Oh, this was the door. That's right. I forgot about that one. All right, use the item. Oh, and he comes with a flashlight. Isn't that awesome? Doing more cat stuff. Yeah, yeah. Okay, what's up here? Anything? Hey, let's knock this stuff over. the code. get this open. Is there a code written down? Code. Three, seven, four, eight. Distance, so I'm guessing it's that light over there. Okay. Nothing really to jump on around here. Cool little graffiti there. So I'm guessing we got to do the bucket thing again. Absolutely stunning set design. I mean, look at this place. For such a simple game, they could have easily chose to do a your typical indie thing where you use the stylized, cartoony uh, visuals. And while it may be cool and and artistic in its own way, it's nothing great. You know, it's like eh. So B12 has the mystery. All right, now we have a postcard. Yeah, 
Hey, you got graffiti all over the walls. Looks like we got another bucket to do here. What do we got? Translate this. Safe zone. All right. Doesn't look very safe. But we'll take their word for it. Ah! It's not safe. It's completely unsafe. Yikes, what are these things? Oh no, I died. <laughs> Eight more lives to go. I got my cat killed. Alright, back into the lying safe zone. You know, they're even trying to There we go. Oh crap! I thought I'd be safe up here. Oh no, that's two down. <laughs> no! So that must not be the place to go. Well, there we go. I didn't see the little jumping thing there. We're in the slums and look at this we've got a robot what <laughs> he's so scared what the hell dude I'm just a little kitty just a friendly little kitty what is that oh mannequin, I assume. Huh. Oh, wait. Is that another guy? I'm digging the music, digging the vibe. Oh man, nobody wants to hang out with the kitty kitty. Yo, you're going down, bro. Look at him run. He's got like a pike. The only robot that's not scared. Did you see his eyes light up? Well, I guess... Listen to the alarms, that's hilarious. I guess those little creatures are zerks and these guys are afraid of them. I'm a cat. I'm a finicky eater. Oh, 
Well, I guess he told everybody I'm cool. <laughs> Check them out, man. They're so scared. So normally I don't like text in games, like communicating. But it works on this one because of the obvious language things. Gotta get up there. All right, my dude. So, what makes you think I want to get out of here? I'm a cat. There's so much to explore. A merchant. Energy drink cans. How do we collect things if we are a simple cat with nary an opposable thumb? Hmm. Well, that's something we're going to have to figure out. Energy drink cans, huh? How do we rub up on guys? I don't know. I thought you could rub up on these little robots. Robot oil. See, I'm assuming these are cans. Do I push them to them? Yeah, okay. Is that all you're going to do? I don't know, am I stuck? <laughs> I'm stuck. Up oh, there we go, got out, okay. Oh look at that, I didn't think we could go this route. Okay. Oh look you can rub up on him, that's cool.
All right, well, we met. Oh, what am I translating? Oh, probably this sign. Barterman Super Spirit Laundry, Grandma Clothing, Elliot Programming. So Super Spirit Laundry is over this way. Here's a bar, okay. So all these places that were closed are now open. so weird. Oh wait, what do we got here? Yeah. Robot oil. Little mini kegs. That guy's just knocked out. Well, let's see what's upstairs. Oh, this is cool. And you can interact with him. That's awesome. <laughs> All right, well, that was fun. Played a game of pool. Oh, yeah, I got some sheet music, okay. Yeah, may as well shred some stuff up, right? Let's start a fire. Okay. Back outside. Those are the guys we were talking to earlier. Okay. Anything else interesting here? I imagine we can shred this too, no? I guess not. All right, well, we're done hanging out at the bar. I think there was another place a little further this way. Look at this. Elliot Programming. Will this mechanic actually do something? Yes, it will. Oh, look at this place. Looks like a memory there. What's up, my dude? Don't mind me, I'm just going to knock everything over and basically ruin your place. That must be Elliot. So 
the robots have beds. <laughs> I thought I was going to pee here. Although, I'm going to say there's plants over here. I'll probably take crap in one of them. Look at that, the mechanic. The, okay. So the scratching mechanic has some use to it. What's up, my dude? Concerned about you. Do I need to scratch at the door again? I could have jumped out that upper window, but I want to see what's down here first. Thank you. Yeah, this is one of the first guys we met. What is this? Grandma clothing. Hey, Grandma. Wow, that's a lot of scars. Alright, so I see there's little side missions and whatnot. Is this the other guy? Oh, who's this guy? He has a beard. Remember if there was anyone else down here. Whoa. It's kind of a sad world. So is this where we came through before? There's a sign. Bar demands for spirit laundry, grandma clothing, Elliot programming. Humans, Ooh. Oh, you're a dark little dude, my friend. Wait. Just got an energy drink. I guess I'm limited to one per machine. Now I'm lost.
Hmm. <coughs> hey, I keep forgetting about the run button, so we came from that way. We've been through here. Come up here. That we saw already. Who's that creepy guy? You just got with the cowboy hat. And yeah, we're back up to here. Cool. All right, well, that's going to wrap up our second episode of Stray. Thanks for joining me today. As always, I'm Captain Beefy with the Game Vault. If you haven't done so, please subscribe to the channel. Ring that bell for notifications. See what this kitty gets up to and uh, what he ends up doing here. And don't forget to leave a comment and a like on the video down below. Tell me where you're looking forward to this game. Uh, is it something you find interesting? I mean, so far, it's pretty cool. They say it's about a four-hour game. It's going to take me a little bit longer, obviously, because I'm just kind of dorking around and having fun with it. But... Um, yeah, look at this. We're really getting high up there. Let's get up some high ground here, and then we'll call it quits. All right. So don't forget also to share us on social media. It is greatly appreciated. I'll see you next time.